Flocon FN02 electric actuator is designed for 24 volt AC DC with 10% tolerance and a 50 or 60 hertz supply with an analog 0 to 10 volts or 2 to 10 volts DC signal. It is self calibrating, complete with feedback position signal. Flow control offer an extended cable, which is cream colored. When the actuators are supplied with a cream colored cable, please note the connecting wire color change. To set up the FN02 actuator dip switches, unscrew the set screw and lift off the cover. The default setting for all the dip switches is the off position, which will satisfy the majority of applications for the green PICV. Switching the dip switch to the on position changes the function. The FN02 actuator is designed to fit the following PICVs. Ensure the actuator is in the fully open position before mounting it on the valve to avoid the risk of damaging the PICV. Align the actuator to the PICV threaded insert. Rotate the locking ring clockwise by hand until hand tight. The actuator is suitable for mounting upside down, but we recommend mounting the actuator above the horizontal body facing upwards. The actuator has a stroke length of 9mm and will self-calibrate to the PICV's closed position when the power is turned on. The stainless steel pin located on the actuator neck will indicate when the actuator is fully closed. The closed position is different for the Green EQ, 0, 1 and 1HF compared to the Green Point 2. During the calibration process, the LED will flash green. Once the actuator locates the closed position, the LED will stay green permanently. No further action is required. The calibrated position will be retained in the actuator memory. Attention! Be aware of the software version of the actuator. Do not calibrate the actuator when it isn't mounted on the PICV. Read the supplementary FNO2 instructions on our website in case the actuator has been calibrated without mounting it to the PICV. To drive the actuator fully open, flip dip switch 6 from the off position to the on position, then back to the off position. The LED will now flash red and green. As well as driving the actuator open, this routine prepares the actuator for recalibration. The actuator will close with the LED flashing green. Once closed, the actuator will be recalibrated and the LED will be solid green. Only remove the actuator from the valve in the fully open position. Drive the actuator open with the control signal or by flipping dip switch 6 to the on position. Once fully open, turn the power off. Dip switch 6 should be reset to the off position and should remain in this position whilst the actuator is not fitted to the PICV. Only remount the actuator onto the PICV in the fully open position. Once remounted, turn the power on. The actuator will recalibrate to the PICV. The feedback signal reflects the actuator's actual position as an electrical signal. It will only equal the control signal when a steady state condition has been reached and the actuator has moved to the required position. For software version specific calibration and fault finding tips, please visit the Flow Control website.